Paul Birmingham here, back with another video on the channel. On today's video, we're going to be doing the preview for tomorrow's match against Rotherham. So before we get into this video, can we hit 10 likes? It'd be greatly appreciated. And yeah, let's get into it. So getting into Rotherham, um, the last game was against Morecambe in the Cup, where they lost 1-0. I don't know how strong the team was they put out in that game, though. So, But they haven't lost a game in the league this season. They drew to um, QPR last last league match they played, but they have beat teams four nil. Um, they've beat Reading four nil this season, so do you never know how things go tomorrow? Look, but we do have a good away record at Rotherham. You know, you know some moment, moment, memorable goals like uh, Clayton Donaldson's goal and Harley Dean's goal, and of course McGomer's goal. Um, so yeah, that we have some very good moments at Rotherham. I can't remember if it was Rotherham away at home. Djokovic got his hat trick, let me know in the comments. But yeah, that was another good moment against Rotherham. I do think we will beat them. I do think we will beat them. But let's get into Birmingham. Coming off the back of an awful match against Wigan, where we couldn't beat 10 men Wigan. Um, it was very, very embarrassing. I hate what that was awful, very awful to watch indeed. Last like last ten, last minute goal. No, not last minute. It was like, I can't remember. But it scored very well late in the game pieces as well, former Villa player, which has just made it even worse, just the tilt end, unbearable to watch that, but don't really blame Eustace, because he's, he, you know, the football he's playing is not even that bad, okay. sometimes it sometimes it looks awful, but again, is it that is that down to our players, because we don't really have much quality on the squad, let's be honest, we can't pass the ball for five seconds without giving it away. We need, we need to bring players in that can actually pass a ball five centimetres. Another thing for this game as well, Djokovic won't be available, so that means we'll probably play Dini and Hogan, probably revert to that back at front again. The score predictions for this game are going to be a 3 0 Birmingham win. I think it'll be one, I'm really hoping we can beat them 3 0. I swear, I, I went for a 3 1 against Wigan as well, and all that didn't turn out very well, so I'm hoping this, this can actually go my way this time and we can actually beat them by a good, a, a good amount of goals. You never know though, do you? You never know we could go and lose, but I'm, I'm positive for this game. I'm very positive. Hopefully, Hogan players like that can get on the score sheet again to boost their confidence up. Let me know your score predictions down in the comments and keep rolling.